Let's, let's go and do some sh footage on this. Okay, so we're turning right towards Vodny and we're going to exercise something called a zip merger. All right, the vehicle in front has a right of way. Yeah, it's pretty busy on a Saturday. I'm here with Chase and it's, um, yeah, slowing down. Push the brakes and stay behind the orange li lines and orange lines. Cool, it's fine. We'll get the next one. No, patience. You can see a whole bunch of arrows up there. We're doing the topic called scanning, scanning for signs today, yeah? Yeah. And that's also we're implementing looking signs and looking for different types of mergers and um, patience in Sydney traffic, yeah? You don't have to push anywhere, you don't have to follow anyone around, yeah? You've got to do your own thing, Chase, yeah? What's required here is before you go over the lines, once we get the arrow, green arrow or a green light, if you want to just go over these lines, you've got to do the checks left, right, okay? And center, especially red light runners and pedestrians walking like that too, yeah? So if you don't do that, you'll fail your test instantly. So that's a good little tip there for you, cool? And if you do that, I'm gonna give you a tick on your sheet, cool? The observation sheet, cool? So already, you already said red arrow up there, haven't you? Yeah. Red arrow with a red light, good. Yeah, this is pedestrian crossings over there. And that's all we see. And um, we just keep rolling. We've been taping for a minute now. Sometimes the lights go on for about a minute and a half, yeah? yeah sometimes it's busy. Sometimes less. Um, in peak hour traffic, um, they, I think the lights take a bit longer. Cool. In non-peak hour, they uh, something they kind of take a bit longer, in a shorter time. If you're busy in the section, like you're crossing one, two, three, four lanes, yeah, they get over there. Follow your dotted line. Check, check. Great. Check there slowly. Follow your own little dot line there. Break a tiny bit. Just so gentle. Look, look ahead. Look at your left mirror. Look ahead and read everything. Uh, you're going to be indicating shortly left, yeah? yeah. Uh, indicate left. Check your side left mirror, side rear mirror. Look, read that. Form one lane. One lane. Vehicle in front has a right away, guys and girls. And there you go. Check your mirror. Form one lane. Cool. The vehicle in front has a right away there. Cool. So we're traveling along. We will stay with the left lane because that's coming filtering out from the, the main road in the tunnel. So yeah. best to stay in your left lane for a long time, yeah? Yeah. For a while now because you're still learning. Cool. Maybe here we're going to go into the highway. It's going to be 80 kilometers an hour. I'd like you to separate your space and keep a nice, generous space between you and the car now. The ground one. Car front. Cool. For you today, you're going to do 65 kilometers an hour. Cool. No more than that. I know it's 80. If you're a learner, we'll be just Cool. Your vision required is way, way up there. Cool. Yeah. Way like 12 seconds, you'll be looking way up there, exercising your far vision. Cool. Far vision. Going to Canberra. We're right, not going there. Man. Over here, it says, what sort of sign is that? On the left, it's blue. It's got a camera. Cameras. All right. Look ahead. You will not go over the speed limit. Cool. So you'll be staying on there. The right lane over there is the overtaking lane. You should not travel in the right lane for too long. The middle lane, okay, you can do 80 there. This one's a slower lane, you do 70. Cool. Look ahead. Oh, try not to jump over the reflectors. Come back here. Beautiful. Look up. Look at the yellow side. It's bend ahead. Near the bridge there, but slightly bends. Cool. I think well done, Chase. 